you guys asked and now we have a multi speaker audio model in this video we are going to install this new higgs audio generation model which is just 3 billion parameter in size and we are going to test it out not only with multi speaker but with also a few other tests all local all free even they have shared the whole source code and i will drop the link to it in videos description this is fahad mirza and i welcome you to the channel if this is the first time you are visiting the channel please like the video and subscribe to the channel now allow me to give you a very quick overview of this model before i start getting it installed so this model provides you an expressive and lifelike speech with robust multi-speaker dialogue capabilities the model has been trained on over 10 million hours of audio and diverse text data without any post training fine tuning the model also shows exceptional performance in generating natural emotionally rich speech across multiple language it also supports zero shot multi-speaker conversation automatic prosody adaption melodic humming with voice cloning and even simultaneous speech and background music generation so there is a lot happening in the model let's check it out i'm going to use this ubuntu system i have one gpu card nvidia rtx a6000 with 48 gpu of vram i'm creating a virtual environment with conda and if you are also looking to rent a gpu on very very cheap prices you can find the link to mast compute in video's description with a discount coupon code of 50 percent for range of gpus let me now git clone the repo of this model that is done and then we all we need to do is to install all the requirements from the root of the repo this is going to take few minutes while that happens let me also introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are Camel AI. Camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws with applications in data generation, task automation, and world simulation. And everything is installed. Next up, let me run this script. I have just altered this script a bit to add a gradio interface on top of it so it is going to open it up in our browser and the model is now running on our local system let me access it in the browser and there you go so it it's a playground where you can select different tts templates there is a smart voice there is a multi-speaker single speaker there is in chinese and then few other languages plus this is a system prompt which you can specify and this changes as per your own template so for example if you go with multi speaker voice it is going to change into this where this is a text and this is um, the different speaker which you are specifying in the scene so i'm just going to go with the smart voice where this is a system prompt with a single speaker i believe and then we have input text and then all we need to do is to generate the speech let's keep all these parameters of generation um as a default let me run this let's wait for it to finish and then i will play the audio and by the way first time when it runs it it downloads the model and you can see that there are three shards of it so let's wait for it to get downloaded the west this simple fact has been observed by humans for thousands of years so it has generated this. Let me play it again. The sun rises in the east and sets in the west. And you might have noticed a little pause. This is not, I believe, the model's fault because I am running it remotely through the uh, VNC client. So maybe that is why. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to download this audio from here. I will move it to my browser and then I will play it there. So this is the audio I'm going to play. Let's check it out. The sun rises in the east and sets in the west. This simple fact has been observed by humans for thousands of years. Okay, not bad, I would say. Let's try out few more. I'm going to go with this multi-speaker. So this is the system prompt where I'm telling it that if the user's message includes a speaker tag, do not read out the tag and generate speech for the following text. And then this is the input text, which is 
are segregated by the speaker so let's run this and while it <clears throat> runs let's also check the vram consumption so it is consuming over 16 gig of vram and it is staying Can't there believe you oh. did that without even asking me first oh come okay so i just want to in, uh tell you that uh, as it starts you might feel some pause that is my vnc client so what this is not a model's fault let me play this i can't, can't believe you did that without even asking me first oh come on it wasn't a big deal and i knew you would overreact like this overreact you made a decision that affects both of us without even considering my opinion because i didn't have time to sit around waiting for you to make up your mind someone had to act pretty interesting and pretty good quality it is quite expressive and human-like i think this multi-speaker is way better than the first one okay let's check out the single speaker voice description again and this is a speaker uh, that he speaks with a clear british accent and a conversational inquisitive tone and then this is the input text let's check it out it doesn't take too long to generate the response which is really really good so it takes around under 10 seconds to generate this let me play this out hey everyone welcome back to tech talk tuesdays it's your host alex and today we're diving into a topic that's become absolutely crucial in the tech world deep learning and let's be honest if you've been even remotely connected to tech, AI, or machine learning lately, you know that deep learning is everywhere. So here's the big question. Do you want to understand how deep learning works? This is pretty impressive, I would say. Okay, let's check out what else is there in the TTS template. So there is this. I'm not sure what uh, that is. It is okay. audio uh, recorded here. And then this is the input text that it's a music one that I will remember this and all that stuff. So let's try it out. It should be fun. And I will let it run and then we will check it out. I will. It is already done. Okay, so I'm going to play it out. I will remember this thought ender when I am defeated. To keep dignity and give honor where it's due so that defeat is not disgrace. And I hope I don't have to do it often. I don't hear the music, but I do hear that it is recorded in the quiet room and you can really, um, you know, sense the reverberation and the echo there. Maybe I will download it in my browser and see if I could hear the music there. Let me try it out there. So I'm going to play out this audio. Remember this, thought under, when I am defeated. To keep dignity and give honor where it's due so that defeat is not disgrace. And I hope I don't have to do it often. So yeah, so we don't see any music here. Anyway, I think still not... Uh, bad i would say let's check out this uh, i believe this is a chinese one okay let's try it out and i think it is bilingual and not a multilingual model let me play this chinese one and if you're a chinese speaker please also confirm希格斯主播代替他讲这期视频。今天我们要聊的是一个你绝对不能忽视的话题。多模态学习。那么，问题来了，你真的了解？Interesting. Okay, let's try out few more in the multi-speaker one because that is, I believe, is the a best one out of all and this is which make makes it very different from the rest of the lot 
so let me change this script here and now let's do the ultimate test and if you're a regular viewer of the channel you know that we have this ongoing problem and we are searching for the solution here where we have this 27 year old neighbor who likes to jump on her trampoline in bikini and the poor um, other neighbor is trying to mow his lawn so this is where the dialogue is happening i'm generating the speech and the speaker is saying i just invented a new dance move and then speaker one says something and then speaker I just, just invent okay i will just let it play again for you i just just invented a new dance move it's called the spaghetti flop watch did you just fall out of a trampoline it's artistic expression yeah and also i may have pulled a muscle yeah but it went viral i have already my lawn eight times today and even dirt is gone now can i mow your lawn there you go that's not bad at all it even i have seen that interject some of the words you see it was saying yeah yeah when speaker zero was uh speaking so it is sort of a conversational too there are a lot of very strong hints so pretty good effort uh, and first attempt i'm very impressed by the model let me know your thoughts please like the video and share it and if you haven't already subscribed please do so as that helps a lot thank you for watching